Good morning. This is the daily lectionary reading. This is Pastor Jeff, Bayview Lutheran Church. Our daily lectionary reading, we are in the complementary uh, section of our daily lectionary. We have our three readings. Psalm 130 is our psalm reading. Deuteronomy chapter 1, verses 34 through 40 is our Old Testament reading. And then 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verses 1 through 5 is our New Testament reading. Let us take a listen in. And today we're going to be reading it out of the New Revised Standard Version. Psalm 130. Out of the depths I cry to you, O Lord. Lord, hear my voice. Let your ears be attentive to the voice of my supplications. If you, O Lord, should make inquiries, Lord, who could stand? But there is forgiveness with you, so that you may be revered. I wait for the Lord. My soul waits. And in this world, I hope. My soul waits for the Lord. More than those who watch for the morning. More than those who watch for the morning. O oh, Israel, hope in the Lord. For with the Lord there is steadfast love, and with him is great power to redeem. It is he who will redeem Israel from all of its iniquities. Our Old Testament reading today comes from Deuteronomy chapter 1, verses 34 through 40. Hear these words. When the Lord heard your words, he was wrathful. And swore, not one of these, not one of this evil generation shall see the good land that I swore to give to your ancestors, except Caleb's son of Jehumha. He shall see it, and to him and to his descendants, I will give the land on which he set foot, because of his complete fidelity to the Lord. Even with me, the Lord was angry on your account, saying, You shall not enter there. Joshua, son of the nun, your assistant, shall enter there. Encourage him, for he is the one who will secure Israel's possession of it. And for you as the little ones, who you thought would become booty, your children, who today do not know yet right from wrong, they shall enter there too. I will give, and they shall take possession of it. But as for you, journey back into the wilderness in the direction of the Red Sea. Our New Testament reading today comes from Second Corinthians chapter 5, verses 1 through 5. Hear these words. For we know that if the early tent we live in is destroyed we have a building from god a house that's not made of hands eternal in heaven for in this tent we groan longing to be clothed with our heavenly dwelling if indeed when we had taken it off we will not be found naked for while we are still in the tent we groan under our burden because we wish not to be unclothed but to be further clothed so that is the mortal way to be swallowed up by life he who has prepared for us this very thing is god who has given us the spirit as guaranteed and here ends our readings for the day.